welcome to another in the series of demonstrations designed to get you quickly up to speed with what's new in NX Cam. This demonstration will show how you can now use an integrated TCL editor in the Post Configurator to more quickly edit and validate TCL code. The editor uses colored text to help you manage syntax, code completion to display valid variables and methods, syntax validation to help you find coding errors, and provides the ability to select any TCL-based file that has sourced your post. In addition, customer defaults allow you to specify default settings for the post configurator. We'll begin by creating a new post processor and observing the new look and behavior of the Edit Post Configurator dialog box. Select Menu. Select Tools. Select Post Configurator. Click Create New Post Processor. Specify the controller manufacturer, and machine. Click OK. Close the information window. Point to New Post in the Post Processor list and notice that there is now a tooltip display. With New Post selected in the Post Processor list, click OK. The New Post Configurator dialog box displays. Select Clamping to display its properties. You can now reset a modified parameter by clicking the icon beside the parameter value. The ability to reset a single parameter saves time and reduces the risk of errors. Select On from the Clamp Status list. The Inherited icon changes to User Defined. Click Inherited to revert the parameter back to the default value. Click Edit Post Configurator File. The Post Configurator File Editor allows you to more quickly edit and validate TCL code. The text is now highlighted in different colors. Black is the standard color. Blue denotes TCL keywords. Green denotes strings. Next, we'll see how code completion displays valid commands as you edit. We'll use code completion to recreate the contents of line 217. On line 218, type LIB. The editor displays valid commands for you to choose from. Syntax validation is done separately. Select a command from the list. The command is added. Press the spacebar and type CON. Again, the editor displays valid commands for you to choose from. Select a command from the list. The command is added. Press the spacebar and type A. Select all from the list. Press the spacebar and type B. Select basic from the list. Press the spacebar and type H. Select hide from the list. Line 218 is identical to line 217. Next, we'll type an invalid command to see how syntax validation allows you to easily find coding errors. Click OK. A warning appears indicating that the post configurator file contains syntax errors. Click Return to Editor and List Errors. An information window displays indicating that we typed an invalid command. Close the information window. Click OK in the editor window. Click Continue in the Edit Post Configurator File window. This action saves the changes made to the TCL file, including the invalid command. Click Edit Post Configurator File. Scroll down and notice that the invalid command has been saved. Backspace over the invalid command and click OK. The warning dialog box no longer appears. Click OK in the Post Configurator dialog box. 
Next, we'll see how you can edit any TCL file that is sourced into your post. To do this, we will add a new TCL layer to the post processor and then observe how you can select it using the new NX user interface. Open the post output folder. Copy the TCL file and rename it. Open the PSC file using a text editor. Copy the TCL file name and paste it at the end of the sequence. Edit the copied file name so that it matches the name of the copied TCL file. Save the file. Close the text editor window. Now we'll see how you can select either one of the two sourced TCL files in the NX user interface. In NX, select Menu, Tools, Post Configurator. With the post selected in the post processor list, click OK. Select the Edit Post Configurator list and notice that you can select either one of the two TCL files to edit. Click Cancel in the Post Configurator dialog box. Lastly, customer defaults for the Post Configurator dialog box have been added. Select Menu, File, Utilities, Customer Defaults. Select Post Configurator. Select Dialog Boxes. Show Filter Group determines whether or not a filter option appears at the top of the Post Configurator dialog box. It allows the content of the dialog box to be filtered by license. This concludes the demonstration of the Post Configurator enhancements that enable you to use an integrated TCL editor to more quickly edit and validate TCL code. Thank you.